Well, they released a new film he this did. week, and Peter Pan and Wendy. Yeah. Which I I've seen. You've seen the first twenty minutes of it. Yeah. Uh, what did you think of the first twenty minutes? Um, turned it off. Shit. Yeah, that's fair. <laughs> uh, I actually I didn't hate it, which shocked me. Mm. Um, I I I mean it's by David Lowery, who I think is a good director generally, and is probably the best guy Disney kind of have in their arsenal. For these kind of yeah. like remakes, yeah, it's yeah. I mean, he it's a low bar from 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 what I saw of it. It just it was like where'd you get up to? What what is? I I barely remember to be honest. Um, were they flying? They flew a little bit. I they saw like I mean, <laughs> I saw like the big like the big band yeah, yeah, yeah. sequence where they that, that's that's cool. <laughs> that's kind of cool. It's it's, it's um, a cool. Okay, we're talking about like, Disney fucking live action remake. It's the trailer shot. Like in, it's in the, Pinocchio, yeah. they fucking and um, Pinocchio walks over to a pile of shit and goes, "Ooh, what's this?" Like, you know what I mean? Like there's fucking <laughs> yeah. there's a low bar. It's yeah. I mean, I don't know. It, it it's Peter Pan. Yeah. It's no, just it, kind of. It's a fucking. I don't I, like how it's lit. Yeah. No, I why, agree. With that. Why is it like a horror movie? Like, <laughs> <laughs> and I think the the guy who plays Peter Pan, God bless. I mean, you, yeah, you wouldn't have fucking got up to this point. So they try to give Captain Hook an emotional backstory. Yeah. Which is like, that's like the big change in the with the remake. Which, yeah, for like, yeah. I mean, fair play to them for making a big change. For doing something different. Yeah. yeah. Because so basically the, the whole big change is, um, so Captain Hook, played by Jude Law, he used to be Peter Pan's best mate as a kid, went to Neverland, missed his mummy, fucking loser came back so like tried to leave Neverland yeah. got lost at sea picked up by the pirates raised by the pirates then came back like a vengeful bitter man who wants to kill all the children yeah which on paper I quite like yeah that's it's like, a bit yeah. stupid but I but I like yeah. it wait so he was raised by vampires vampires <laughs> pirates yeah, I mean fucking <laughs> yeah, so pirates yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, so it's like yeah so how young was he? Like Peter Pan's age, so like. I was gonna say 14. like. Because like because like to me I was like imagine like a baby <laughs> like getting raised by vampires. <laughs> I'm like but by va- I keep saying vampires <laughs> getting raised by pirates, but then I'm like how the fuck did a baby do all the other stuff before? <laughs> uh, but he's so like it's fine and then fucking end. Mm. But then in the actual acting like execution side of it, Jude Law does really well. Oh. He's a good actor. Yeah, it's Jude Law. The boy who plays Peter Pan doesn't quite nail the meticulous... Because obviously he's meant to be, like, fucking Captain I feel like Hook. you're being really nice. <laughs> like, yeah. You're like, you don't want to be too... He's, he's, like, obviously meant to be Captain Hook's ex-best friend turned bitter enemy, which is a very complex relationship to play. Yes. And he doesn't quite have the experience and chops to play it. Yeah. As well. Like, for instance, the girl who plays Wendy, Ever Anderson... Hmm. Who is Paul W. S. S. Anderson and Mila Djokovic's door, I think. Really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, wow. She's found in the film. Mm. Uh, the best stuff is generally Wendy and Hook. That makes so much sense because she looks a lot like yeah, yeah, yeah. Mila Djokovic. Yeah, like, that, totally that, that would be her face. Yeah, no, that makes so much... I, I, I literally remember like, looking and I was like, I like recognise her, but yeah, I'm also like, yeah. I don't know... But... I don't know. That's why. But yeah, that's yeah. why she looks a lot like yeah. her. Yeah, yeah. That's um, weird. And she like she does well in the film. Um, there's like a good sequence where it's like her jumping off the fucking shit. They give her a bit more to do. Yeah. Um, which is quite nice. They also what they do because they they prioritize Peter Pan and Wendy more in the Peter Pan and Wendy film, obviously. But like the main core of the film is obviously the Peter Pan and Captain Hook stuff. What that does mean is so many of the fucking supporting characters, like the Lost Boys. And the other darling siblings. They were like push this. Hey, fuck out, fuck off. <laughs> I forgot the boys were in it. Like, the two fucking other boys. I yeah. uh, like top hat, glasses nerd. He's like barely in the fucking film. Yeah. Um, and so it's a bit of a weird film because it's it's trying to both be a fucking shot for shot remake mm. at times, but then also wants to do its own thing. Yeah. So it's it, it feels like it's definitely held back by the fact that it is a Disney live action remake rather than. A fucking adaptation of Peter Pan. Yeah, yeah. But it's it, it's fine. It's watchable, and it feels like it's made. It's not by Pinocchio. Human. Exactly. Yeah. It's it. There's a lot of ways you could do. Yeah, 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 yeah. And I'm definitely being overly nice to it because it's a Disney live action remake, and the fucking bar is so low at this point. 
Um, but it's not fucking Pinocchio. It's I think not Lion King. What is really funny though about yeah. these like David Lowry ones is it's so obvious. This is such like a one for me. One for oh yeah, absolutely. Kind of deal. It's like he's he's obviously like you know like he did like Peter Dragon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He did that to Ghost Story. Oh, absolutely. That's why. Because yeah, like yeah, 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 you know you know and he's doing this probably so he could fund whatever he's doing next. Which is great. 